What is up, YouTube? What's happening? What's going on? I just finished another workout, day two of my workouts, actually day six of uh, since my surgery. I had the vertical sleeve gastrectomy surgery six days ago on September 1st, 2016. Tomorrow marks a one week surgery anniversary. So I was gonna wait and go to the gym tomorrow, but I'm gonna go, to, I went tonight and I'm gonna go tomorrow. What I did today, I actually got on the treadmill for a little bit. Um, I did one mile, it took me about 25 minutes, but I had the incline on, uh, I changed it. I started at three on the incline till about, um, till about 75, I, I, well, not 7, 0.75 or three laps. Uh, the last lap, I cranked it up to uh, seven on the incline. Uh, at 2.5 on the speed on both settings. Uh, I'm going to tell you, that killed me. <laughs> it, it, it gave me a good workout. So, as you can see, I got a nice little glisten going. Um, I'm still drinking uh, some of the IsoPure. Fun fact, um, I don't know if, I've, I've, if I mentioned this before, but if you mix the IsoPure with some Crystal Light, completely changes the game. Uh, as far as the taste, Crystal Light adds some of the crystal like taste to it and it kind of takes over from that bland isopure which hey isopure is good stuff but it seems like right at the end of the taste you can taste the whey the the whey and the protein so i really didn't like it so what i've been doing is i'll pour it into a water bottle uh i pour it into a water bottle about halfway with um isopure and well, no, about three quarters of the way with Isopure and just top it off with, with the um, Crystal Light. It just adds another flavor to it. It doesn't take it, it, it doesn't overpower it to where it's more, you know, uh, more, uh, what, am I, what am I wanting to say? To where it's more Crystal Light than Isopure. So you're still getting a good, good solid balance of the protein. Um, after I get home, I'm on, I'm on my way to the house now. I'm gonna get showered. Um, I've been eating some cream of chicken soup. Uh, probably I can get right now about, I would say five tablespoons and then I'm full. Um, I'll probably after that have either um, a sugar-free um, pudding or uh, just some jello or something like that. And then that'll be it for the night as well as trying to get some more water in my system. Uh, tomorrow I plan on getting some uh, either Propel or g2 just for electrolytes i've been a little lax like just real laxed and almost fatigue during the day and then i've been getting a lot of fluids a lot of liquids in me but i just feel like i need to i still need to get even more hydrated so i'm hoping that the g2 or propel will give me that edge that i need anyways short video like i said i'm already at what three minutes and 20 seconds go ahead and make it a quick video just an update tomorrow is day seven I will do a video for day seven. I'm not gonna have a wait yet. It's not gonna be until I have my follow-up on September the 14th, so I got another week. Uh, Y'all just stay with me. I'm so excited to see what it's gonna say next week. Uh, that's why I wanna go really, really hard uh, up until then so I can blow that scale out of the water. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything like that, hit me up. Um, again, if you're thinking about doing the sleeve, don't hesitate. You should have done it yesterday. Don't wait, change your life, be great lose weight, feel great, all that good stuff. I'll talk to y'all later. See y'all tomorrow.